Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a common challenge that many developers encounter as they build their applications. Our viewer is learning to break their project into components, but is feeling overwhelmed by the growing number of import statements in their tab view. They ask, how can they clean up these imports as they add new cards and Redux actions? Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully getting you to that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy just like me and get through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. To clean up your import statements, a common approach is to create an index file in your components directory. This file will consolidate all your exports into a single location. In your index.js file, you can import all the components and then export them. This way, you can import them from a single source in your main file. Now, instead of importing each component individually, you can import them all from the index file. This significantly reduces the number of import statements. For your Redux actions, you can apply a similar strategy. Create an index file in your actions directory to consolidate your action imports. Finally, update your main file to import all actions from the new index file, keeping your code clean and organized. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To clean up your import statements, consider adding an index.js file in your actions and components directories. This allows you to import multiple items in a single line. In the components index.js, you can directly export your components since they have default exports. After setting up your index files, your import statements will be much cleaner and more organized. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To clean up import statements in your modules, you can use Webpack's Resolve Alias feature. This allows you to create shortcuts for commonly used folders, making your import paths shorter and cleaner. For example, instead of writing long relative paths, you can import components like this. Import component from components my mycomponent.js. Here, at represents your sarsi folder. Alternatively, you can use absolute paths directly, such as import component from component slash mycomponent.js. This works regardless of your current folder structure. To set this up, you can modify your webpack.config.js file to define the aliases for your folders, like this, utilities and templates. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To 
clean up import statements in your modules, it's okay to have many imports in your components. However, combining components into one file is usually not a good idea. Instead, break them into smaller components to reduce dependencies. Consider using additional abstractions like higher order components or hooks. They can help decrease duplication and improve the diversity of your components. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To clean up import statements in your React modules, it's best not to keep all components in a single file. Instead, modularize your structure. If you want to reduce the number of import statements, create a separate file for exports. For example, you can create an imports.js file. In your imports.js file, you can export all necessary components and actions. Then in your main file, you can import everything from this single file. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To clean up your import statements, create an index.js file in your components folder. This allows you to consolidate multiple imports into one. Now you can import all your components in a single line making your code cleaner and more manageable. And that's it, guys. I hope we found the solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.